Hey guys, it's KJ48. Welcome back to my The Long Dark Let's Play. This is going to be a new season. We're going to start season two, and this is going to be part one. And this is going to be alpha version 1.156. Uh, there was a major update and a smaller hotfix update, and uh, we'll go over the hotfix update a little, maybe, you know, in the next video or two, if I remember. But uh, I'm going to actually go over the ma major changes in this update uh, as I play. I might have to pause the game from here there, uh, here and there, but for now we're not going to worry about that. Let's go through story mode as the guy. Confirm. Mystery Lake. Uh, is oh! Oh, I didn't even know that Coastal Highway is a different place. I thought these two places were the same... Now, is Mystery Lake and Coastal Highway in the same area? Like, can you get from one to the other, or are they completely different? Okay, I just looked it up. Oh my god, this first screen's so loud. But uh, I just looked it up, and apparently the new sandbox region added Coastal Highway. To travel to it, follow the railway in Mystery Lake on the dam side. So apparently you can start at either place, but they are actually connected. So for a new spot, we're going to start at Coastal Highway and see where this takes us. Oh man, it's pretty cool. I didn't I didn't realize that, like they were two spots in the same world that you could travel between, but you could choose to start which place to stay at uh, to start at. That's pretty interesting. At least I hope I'm reading that right. Um, I'll go over some of these update notes. Long term starvation now affects fatigue. If you starve for too long, it becomes le less difficult to avoid exhaustion. The fatigue increase due to starvation is gradually reduced, but not by not starving. Okay. And uh, let's get started here. I will try and find a place to stay. I will pause the video from time to time to read the patch notes. But uh, I am going to pay full attention to the game while I'm playing it. Alright. Um, oh, is that water or ice? It's got to be ice, right? Yep, it's ice. Man, look at this lake. Wait. Is this the lake? Okay, so, wow, we're at... Is this Mystery Lake? I'm, I'm kind of noob at this game, but this looks like the lake that, you know, I get all the goodies at, that I stayed last time. Let's take a look at the things and see if anything's different here. Um, okay, it says if stuff's going up or down, my hunger's going up, the air temperature is not too bad. Uh, I'm going to look at some of our stuff here. We'll probably start off with about the same stuff. So, yeah. I don't see anything about... Cal oh, there's my calories? Okay. Um, they removed the concept of calorie... Uh, deficient. I'm not sure what that. What, I'm not even sure what that was. So I guess I'm not gonna miss it. Um, added a rate of change of change indicators on the sub conditions. This should help. Yeah, that was the. That's these things right here. These arrows. I'm assuming. Um, okay, so let's get started. We're gonna start looting up. I'll I'll go over these patch notes as we go along. All right. All right. Come on. Come on. Come on. Nothing. Nothing. I'm worried they nerfed the loot. That'll come in handy. Okay, let's take that. Actually, if if the loot is better and they nerfed it, I'm okay with that. Um, so let's see what we got here. Beans, uh, beans and molasses with bits of what looks like pork. It's got the weight, conditions, calories 600. So that has been upped. So I think they upped the calories on the, can the, like the, the canned food, like the food you find. But I do know for a fact that they have lowered the calories on... The meat you'll find from dead deers and, and stuff like that. So, um, yeah. There are now rabbits in the game. You can now craft snares at a workbench if placed where the ra Okay, so the snares are really awesome. Because if any of you guys ever watched Survivor Man, um, he, like, he put out snares. He actually caught a rabbit once. Uh, it's pretty cool. So I do like the whole idea of snares. So you can now put up snares to catch rabbits. Uh, there's, uh, if you place in a world where you see rabbits, there's a chance you'll capture a rabbit every 12 hours. So... I'm kind of wondering, like, how close it has to be where I found the rabbits. Like, does it have to be actually on the rabbit trail or just in the general vicinity? Or, I don't know. I'm going to have to see. Alright, this does not look familiar. Let's not run so much. Alright. It's really, it's kind of annoying you can't jump. I kind of wish you could jump, even if you couldn't jump high. <sighs> like, seriously, why can't I? <sighs> that was a bug. I, sh I was able to walk by that. Alright, so we got a bunch of cabins up here. Um, what time is it? Uh, what time is it? Is there anywhere to see the time? 
Oh, 5.51 p.m. Okay. Whoa, 5.51 p.m.? What the hell time did we start? It's almost night time. Alright, let's see if we can do some looting here. Nope, nope. Whoa, shoot, that scared the crap out of me. Oh, he's scared of me too! See, now that's the way a wolf would act. Like, if a wolf was on his own, um, if you startled him, I mean, there's a chance they would attack. But, uh, wolves attack in packs. There's, I don't think there's... There's very little, like, chance that a wolf's gonna actually attack you, like, right off the bat. Um, although I guess there's, I guess if you do startle them and scare them, there's a chance they could, uh, they could attack you, but it's not guaranteed, like, in this game. Well, at least, like, it was. Workbench. Here we go. Snares. We need guts. Well, that's what the guts are for. And we need reclaimed wood. Okay. We'll have to keep that in mind. Right, let's check out this cabin. Let the looting begin. Uh, what's that? Sardines. Uh, 300 calories. We've got some newspaper. Uh, we got a metal container. Uh, candy bars. What are those up to? 250? What were candy bars before? 175 or 200? I can't remember. All right, so we need a crowbar to force that that one locker. What have we here? Okay, I don't see anything else in here. I believe the game saves when I walk out the door, so that's good. Six thirteen in the in PM. Wait, PM? It looks like the sun's coming up. Doesn't it look brighter than before? Uh, I think they got their AMs and PMs mixed up. Cause you would they wouldn't start you they wouldn't start you in the game at night, right? They might have got the AM and PM mixed up, I'm thinking. Look at all this wood, why can't I take this? Well maybe because I don't have an axe. Actually, I, you could break up those uh, pallets without an axe. I've done it in real life. I grew up on a farm, we had a lot of pallets. I you know, I could break those up easily. Very easily. Alright, let's continue the loot fest. Loot simulator! Alright, see the calories are dropping a lot. A lot slower. See, cold is going down. Okay. Good. Good, good, good. Hope nobody needs this anymore. Seems like there's a lot more food, too, so that's, that's nice. Why can't I pick up that backpack and use it? Mittens. Alright, let's see what we're looking at here on equipment. Let's go to clothing. Uh, sort by condition. Uh, we're not wearing the mittens. What does the mittens take off? They probably take off the gloves. So those are nine and four, and these are four and four. So yeah, let's uh, let's wear the mittens. Uh, nothing else. Okay. Uh, what's my weight at? Oh, seven of thirty. We're doing okay. Hopefully there's less clothes in the game, too, because last time there was just way too many clothes. And uh, I know I didn't have to take them all, but, you know, my I have a compulsive need to loot everything. Looks like this has been here a while. Jeans, huh? I don't see how that's going to help. Can we wear the jeans? Probably not. Clothing, condition, basic clothes. We got jeans. The jeans are 9 and 0. What will they replace? Will they replace the underwear? They're probably going over the underwear, I would think. Oh, I already had jeans. What am I thinking? Four and nine. Okay. So, we'll, we'll, yeah, we'll definitely hold on to those. I could use this. Yes, you could use socks. Well, if you're not wearing socks, dude, you're in a bad... I mean, like, really, what would you be doing out here without socks? He's probably got socks on. But maybe these will be better. Those don't look like shoes you'd be wearing. In any kind of a uh, snowy area. <laughs> Alright, let's see what we got here. Gloves, jeans, what do we get? Shoes? That's garbage. There's no way that my boots are worse than that. Yeah. Uh, socks, right? Cotton socks. Much better than nothing. Do I... I got wool socks. So that's four and that's one. Oh yeah, those are definitely better. Alright, we're good. We are good. Uh, 
Anything else? I don't see anything. Really like to find a lantern. We'll see. I'm worried that wolf might go bring its pack back, but I don't think wolves think like that. Like, I don't know if a wolf sees you and like runs away because it's scared. Is it gonna? It's not gonna go get its buddies and say, hoo, hoo, "Let's go this way." No, I don't think that's the way wolves operate. But who knows? Maybe. Problem with these rooms is I don't see any place for a fire in them. But I don't think cold's really gonna be a problem to be honest. Let's uh. Lantern fuel. Now as we need a lantern. Okay, here we go with the wood. Uh, wood doesn't seem that heavy. 0 0.2, 0 0.25 kilograms? I, I thought it was heavier than that. Maybe it depends on what kind of wood you get. I know there's different kinds of wood in the game. One, one part of the update is, uh, you can, like, change what kind of wood you go after. Uh, I don't know where I saw it. Let's take a look at it. Reduce the general availability of first aid items. They are now mainly found in appropriate first aid containers. <laughs> Interesting. Uh, that's good. Yeah, the the PM and AM is is backwards. So just letting you guys know that. Bug fix, bug fix. PM and AM is backwards. All right, let's get out of here. Okay, I looked up what I was looking for. Um, you can now select what type of fuel source you are looking for when forging wood. I.e., it is no longer random. That's what I wanted to tell you guys about. Okay. Oh, maybe the AM and PM. It, no, that's the, that's the sun. It looks. Man, this game looks. This game looks beautiful. Look at that. I think the AM and PM is mixed up. I can't tell. I'm pretty sure that's the sun. <laughs> if that's the moon, it's a bright moon. But I don't know. I guess at this la latitude, the sun will not go straight overhead. Um. At this at this um, area of the world, the sun won't go this way. It basically goes like this way because we're not the the Earth's like tilted off angle from the sun, so it's not going to go directly overhead. All right. Uh, okay, so I guess this place has been kind of looted, but, come in handy. but people were probably in a hurry, so that's why some of these drawers are open and some of them have stuff in them. Or maybe people who looted only looted what they could take, you know, maybe uh, they couldn't hold all the items. Not like me, where I take every damn thing I get my hands on. All right, I don't think I have a, another... Oh, I have a two... Eight and eight. That's garbage. Let's go ahead and harvest some of this stuff. That was another thing I didn't like. I thought the time went by too quickly while harvesting. But that was more of a food problem. So now that food's not, you know, as much of a problem, it's more manageable. I don't really mind. So I'm assuming... Wait, actually, we should look at this. I'm assuming the cloth I get is less weight than the items. That's that's a good question. Okay. So let's look at mittens here. Mittens are 0.25. Uh, jeans are 0.5. 5, 0.5, 0.5, uh, that's 1. So we're looking at cotton socks are 0.10. So we're looking between 0.10 and 1 kilograms. Let's see what cloth weighs. That's important because uh, when we're talking about capacity for our weight, we need to be careful. Uh, materials, cloth is 0.3. Wow, cloth is pretty heavy. Now, is that 3 for all of them or just each one? It's probably each one, I think. Point three. Let's break up one more item. Point three for cloth. Okay. So we'll break up one more item and then we'll be able to t actually we might not have another item. Yeah, we have another item we could break we could break up. We could break up the socks. Okay, so cloth is point three kilograms. That's actually quite heavy. Uh I don't think cloth should really be that heavy, although I guess it could technically be a lot of cloth. Yeah, okay. So it's not point three per cloth, it's point one zero per cloth. That that makes a lot more sense. So cloth is fine. Uh, you could basically break up any any clothing you're not using and break it up into cloth. Uh, the only thing that I wish they would change, and this is very important, they really need to change this. Okay, so each of these stats for warmth and windproof bonus, I am under the assumption that these stats change 
depending on the condition of the item. Like jeans are at 0 0.5 degrees, uh, plus 0.5 Celsius. If the condition gets lower, that 0.5 is gonna drop. If the condition goes up, the 0.5 will go up. As a matter of fact, I could probably test that right now. Uh, let's repair something. We'll repair the mittens. But we need to see the stats on the mittens. Um, all right, hold on, we gotta look at the stats. This is important for me to have an idea what's going on. Okay, so the mittens are nine and four. Just remember that, nine and four, nine and four. Nine and four, mittens, sewing kit repair. Nine and four. Nine and four. See, I like the game a lot more when I'm not starving to death every 20 seconds because now I have a chance to find out how the game works, you know? Uh, nine and four, nine and four, mittens. Okay. That's official. By the way, those mittens are really good warmth bonus. It's official. Uh, the warmth and windproof bonus does go up as the items are repaired. Okay. So what I need in this game, what this, what I need them to do with this game, and this is important. Uh, you see how the the let's take the basic boots. Okay. They're seventy seven percent condition. Point uh, eight Celsius warmth bonus. I need to know what the warmth and windproof bonus of these items will be at full condition. Because if I have two different items, like uh, if I have like, I don't have two different items right now, but let's say I had these, uh, the toque and I had a wool hat and one is at one condition and the other one's at another condition. Um, I can see what their warmth and windproof bonus are uh, at their respective position uh, conditions, like 84%, maybe one's 84% and one's 54%, but they have this, but they have different wind warmth and bonus windproof bonus. I don't know what their warmth and windproof bonus on the high end will be when the items completely are uh, repaired, and that's what I need to know. By the way, I think the AM and PM might actually be working because it seems pretty dark in here now. Um, all right, one second. Let me uh, find the door. Where's the door? Where's the damn door? Okay, match. What's the match button? There we go. There we go. Okay, so I don't I don't know. Like, it didn't start getting dark till 8 o'clock at night. That doesn't make any sense. How would it get dark at 8 o'clock at night this far north? That's why I thought the AM and PM were mixed up. The AM and PM are not mixed up, but they're a little off. I mean, it didn't get dark till 8 or 9. That, that would never happen. Um, how many matches do I have? I don't want to be wasting matches. Mm, material other uh food and drink first aid clothing where's matches material cloth newspaper newsprint reclaim wait where, where's matches alphabetical matches matches uh what are they called matches maybe they're called something else Book of matches, maybe? Did I just use up my last match? No. Do you have unlimited matches? I'm confused. Accelerate. Uh, give me one second. Okay, I'm, I'm confused. Um, I, do I have unlimited matches or what? Like, what's the deal? Why, why don't I have matches, but I can still bring them up? Uh, if you guys know, just let me know in the comment section. All right, so let's go with food and drink. Let's go ahead and uh, eat some. Let's do it by condition. Eat the beef jerky. And we are thirsty. So let's go ahead and drink nothing. Oh, boy, we don't have anything to drink. Um, all right, we're going to have to go to sleep. Deal with the, the drink in the morning. Rifle round. What have we here? Huh. I guess if I, if I have an unlimited matches, I might as well just use them. Okay. Let's go to bed. Uh, we want to wake up at... Let's just sleep six hours for now. Okay, well, so far, I'm really liking this update. I like the new areas. I like the, I like the, I like what they did with the loot. I like what they did with the food. I'm not in such a hurry. I can actually enjoy the game, you know? Uh, although, my thirst is kind of a problem. Alright, so what we're gonna do is we are kind of, like, 
forced to go outside and try and start a fire and boil some water out there because uh, we are dehydrated, like, very badly. Alright, so let's go to here. Start a fire. It's too windy to start a fire. Oh, boy. Does that mean I can't start it anywhere? Or do can I find a place to start it? Seriously, man, like, <laughs> I can't start a fire now. Like, you're killing me. Whoa. Ah, uh, so I have nothing to drink and I can't start a fire because it's too windy. Uh, I don't know what to do. <laughs> this is really getting me into a predicament here. I don't want to eat because I'm afraid it's going to, uh, it's going to dehydrate me even more. So let's sleep for another hour. Hopefully the wind will die down. I don't know if I should go looting or try and boil snow. I think I want to try and boil snow. Yeah, I mean, I'm kind of at the mercy of the game. They just didn't give me any, like, liquids to loot, you know? And it's, and it's windy, so what, what am I supposed to do with this? And there's wolves outside. Like, <laughs> I'm kind of, like, trapped here. Uh, kind of screwed. I don't know what I'm supposed to do. We'll sleep for one more hour, and then um, we're going to have to... We're going to have to run out. We got no choice. I don't know what I'm supposed to do. I mean, they didn't give me any liquids. Um, maybe I spent too much time learning the game. I don't know, but like, I don't know. Is it still too windy? No, it's not. Okay. Uh, we got wood. Oh, see, we only have seven wood matches. It wasn't telling me how many wood matches I had. That's not fair. I'll die if I don't drink something soon. Yeah, I got it. Uh, add to the fire. We got no more. Let's, uh, let's do a liter of snow. Melt a liter of snow. And then we will boil a liter of water. Then we'll do uh, 0.5 liters, and then 0.5 liters. We should have enough for that. Come on, boil. Boil, damn it. Six, five, four. All right, that was good. All right, equipment, food and drink, water. Drink that sucker. Wow. Yeah. That's where we roll. That's how we drink water, people. Uh, we're hungry again. Let's uh, let's go ahead and have some pork and beans. Oh, I need something to open it. Uh, okay, so we'll hold off on the pork and beans for now. I really like what they've done with the game. Uh, I kind of got in a little trouble here with the dehydration, but, you know, it is what it is. Did I loot this place? Yeah, I looted all these things, I think. Did I loot that one? Yeah, yeah, that was the first one I looted. I wish you could draw a little, like, a little mark on the cabins or something to kind of mark the ones you've been at. This will be our last loot for this video because we, our timer is just about up. Oh, Jesus Christ, freaking wolves. Hope nobody needs this anymore. All right, let's fight. Oh, or not. It's, what, what am I supposed to do? Alright, we got matches, that's nice. Flares used to scare wolves, but not anymore. Get off me! Oh, come on, you didn't even die? First aid, I don't have any first aid. Oh, yeah, I do. Uh, so what do I need here? Let me see. They don't even die now! Like, that sucks! Uh, blood loss, we need bandages. See, they used to die and you could at least get the meat off them. Now, I don't, you don't feel e so good. Now you don't even get anything. Wow, that's weak sauce, man. Infection risk, put in the antiseptic. At least you start off with some antiseptic. There's a lot of wolves out here, though. <laughs> 
All right, guys, that is going to do it for part one, and we'll see you next time for part two. Till then, take it easy.